across the world 40 years later as they help each other get through lockdown. That my era, that is, believe me. A school band from Louth, which was formed in the early 70s, has reunited over the internet to continue their music 50 years on. Fagin, this is what they were called, used to do shows around the Louth area until A-level split them up, even though they'd been getting rave reviews in the local press. Now, over lockdown, they've been getting rave reviews over the internet instead. Simon Spark has more. This is Fagin, reformed over the internet after almost 50 years. We have David in the USA, Peter in Suffolk, and Chris in Louth. They originally formed in school before further education tore them apart. But Louth Town Hall is where Chris originally got his inspiration from local bands at the time. When we were teenagers, we used to come to the odd gig. Uh, you see some of the bigger bands of the day. It was one of those thoughts, yes, I want to be up there and have a go. Can I learn that too? What's he playing? Where's his fingers going? God, you look so young, but then I guess so did I. Even at school, they were playing well enough to be noticed by ex loud leader and BBC Radio Humberside journalist Mike Cartwright. Fagin, one of the best young groups to come out of Louth, are in a nasty predicament. All but one are taking A-levels this year. This means that midweek gigs must fall by the wayside to make way for the build-up effort for the exams. I remember being very impressed by their playing. Um, they were a bit different to the usual young covers bands of that time. They, but they were choosing the kind of bands that I used to like to listen to. People like Jethro Tull, uh, people like Cream, these sort of bands. Um, and they put their own little bit of an edge to it. And they're still doing that now, of course, now that they've reformed. And I, 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 um, I just thought, yeah, they caught my ear. These articles really were a shot in the arm. It, it really brought us to the fore in little old Louth uh, that we were available. But why and how, after so many decades, have they got back together now? It just kind of happened last September when I was visiting there. Uh, but I saw Chris and then I went down to see Peter and Peter snagged the secret video of his playing so I said, right, let's, let's do it properly. And this has been quite something because I, I feel that the, the music that we're playing today is pretty much what we used to do. The great thing is the music that we played then is still fantastically popular today. I find the uh, time scale quite scary, to be honest. Also, it's quite interesting that you never really forget the structures of the songs and have got that sort of rapport between ourselves, um, which I don't think we've ever lost. They still have material to be finalised and performed, but you'll just have to keep watching them to see and hear what comes next. Simon Spark, BBC Look North, Laugh. Brilliant. I saw the music, they make a good sound, that's uh, Fagin. Now let's have a reminder of the headlines, that coming in.